Hi guys, Lee Sanford here from Trading College. I do hope you're well. Um, do excuse the tracksuit uh, that I'm wearing. Uh, I went out for a bit of uh, some exercise at lunchtime. I really do need it. I'm putting so much weight on uh, after Christmas. I need to go and do some exercise, okay? So um, it was lovely. Sun was shining and what a beautiful day it was here in London. Hope you've had the sun where you are. It's been an absolutely gorgeous day. But let's take a look at the markets. We got President Trump um, inauguration going on as we speak. Um, you're probably watching this video. It is Friday evening time in London here. You're probably watching this video um, a little bit later on and it's all over and done with. But I want to take a look at the charts here and, and see what's setting up in the markets for, the, for next week or for tonight. Um, who knows what's going to happen? The only thing I'm going to trade and which I always do with my trading guys, is trade the chart. I'm not interested in the news, uh, what could happen, because it's all priced in the chart for me. And uh, from an analyst point of view, it's there. The footprint is on the chart, okay? So let's go and see what is setting up and what could happen uh, post, um, post Friday here. So this is what I'm looking for. Um, we have this, this is the, the Dow Jones, by the way, on the daily time frame using Pro Real Time with our Pro Trading system and indicators in here. Now, green means buy, of course, and we get this buy signal and the markets push up. Incredible move higher, big impulsive move. Looks like a wave three type of, of move here. Um, so, this is what's, what I think could happen. If we close red, when it's red on the Pro Trading system, that means that it's it's looking a bit bearish. Sellers are taking over from the buyers. If it's green, the, the buyers are, you know, it's bullish. The market's going up normally. The buyers have stepped in on that day. The sentiment on that day is bullish. Now the sentiment on this chart is bullish, but the candlestick is bearish because it's red, okay? Bullish is an uptrend here. We've got the moving averages stacked underneath price. When moving averages get underneath the price like they are here, it's got room to take off the market. And so with the same with the short side, it's got room to go down when those moving averages come down on top of price. It's like a bit of a brick wall or it's support underneath price. So we've had a nice move up, but now these moving averages are starting to get broken and we're seeing red candlesticks. Now, if we close with red candlestick Friday night, I think this opens the door for a move back down, potentially, back down to 19,200 on the Dow Jones here. All right, that has potential. I think we could roll and go back down. This is the 50 period. I think we'll break that and push lower. Then we could start a new move to the upside, okay? Now, if we turn green, green means buy on the ProTrend system. I'm gonna keep it simple. If it turns green, we're gonna break that 20,000. If we break that 20,000, then I think that we're gonna have a bigger move down from there as well. I think we are due a correction. I think we are going to correct. It's just about timing, isn't it? And looking at other time frames and, and looking to see where the path of least resistance is. On the daily, it's just one time frame. But there's so much going on on other time frames that I need to keep an eye on. Now, if we start to roll over here and go down and stay red on the pro train system, I'm going to go down to smaller time frames and have low risk trades, low risk entries, small stop losses and bigger rewards. And so on Tuesday night, guys, we're going to be speaking about that at the webinar. So don't forget, you're going to be sent a webinar link, <coughs> excuse me, and we're going to talk about trading multiple time frames. This daily time frame does not give me enough picture, uh, picture of what's going on on other time frames. You know, it just doesn't tell me the whole story. So I'm going to show you what I do and how to go and get some really easy money and free money on a regular basis every day. You're probably leaving so much money on the table by not looking at other time frames. What I mean by that is like looking at weeklies and monthlies as well. You know, when I'm day trading off a five minute chart, 15 minute chart, I'd be looking at the monthly. Now, what I like, what I see normally, and what happens when people look at too much information, they get what we call analysis paralysis. Us human beings, we cannot take in and process too much information. And so we then start to get frustrated, lose confidence. We go on and you end up losing money because you lose that confidence, you do silly things, okay? So I'm gonna teach you how I keep it simple by looking at more time frames, but keeping it 
really small and the opportunities are there every single day. Even if you've got a full-time job, your opportunity to make some money in the markets, knowing where these key levels are, knowing where and how to use multiple timeframes will really help you with your trading, okay? So free webinar on Tuesday night and we're gonna go through sort of, and we're gonna look at those multiple time frames, sort of setups and trades, all right? So make sure you look out for that uh, webinar link and email, all right? So the Dow here, once again, if we stay red, there is a chance Monday, Tuesday, we go down for another leg to the downside here. And I'll be looking for downside movements and short movements in, our, in the live trading rooms. If we turn green, we're gonna go back up, maybe for two or three days, and then have the potential to go back down and turn back red. All right, that's what I'm looking for. I think this trend is tired. I think it does have potentially one more move up. Um, and I would say this is a way three. I think the next pullbacks are four. The next pull, um, impulsive moves are five. And when we get that, we're gonna have massive bearish divergences. And we've got all sorts of bigger time frames to look at as well on Tuesday night. Have a great rest of the weekend, guys, and um, just enjoy what you're seeing on, on TV, I suppose, with uh, President Trump. And uh, who really, it doesn't really matter what happens, does it? We just want to trade the chart because it's all in the chart. Hope it helps. Bye-bye.